Attention, yo, attention. It's Benny and I'd like to mention I'm on the microphone this morning. Honk your horn if you want it. Okay, we got traffic on the west side. Get My name is Ed Brazo, and I'm the director of our current spring musical production of In the Heights here in Shasta Hall in the University Theater. And don't take the Deegan. Manny Ramirez is in town this weekend. Sorry, Dominic, sick, Route 87. You ain't getting back in again. Hold up. We decided to do this show because not only is our student body a large mixture of different ethnicities, but we also thought this show would be great for the Sacramento community. It's a, a, it was a very popular show and it won Best Direction, Best Choreography, Best Book, and Best Musical. Created, written, and conceived by Lynn manuel Miranda, who is the current creator of Broadway's mega-hit, Hamilton. We're having a great time with this show. The show contains so many different themes. It's about love, it's about happiness, it's about sadness. It's about neighborhoods. It's about people coming together to help each other. And I've been very impressed with the way the students have created these characters. How's it going? So I got you a present. I went downtown to get it. Doing anything tonight. Cleaning. Done for the day. Okay. Cause we got a date. No way. Before you board that plane. We're very happy to have a live orchestra, and we have a great conductor, great vocal director. I've been at Sac State for 17 years now, and I taught at another school for 10 years, so I'm 26, 27 years into teaching. And I usually direct the musical every year. Some years I have not, and several years I used to choreograph my own musicals. But I'm very thrilled to be collaborating with Lisa Ross and Gino Platina, they love the show, they're, they're loving the music, the students are loving the choreography that they've given them, and I've enjoyed collaborating with them very, very much. As well as Luann Higgs, our vocal director. She's a great voice teacher, full of patience. It's been hard learning this show vocally. It's a very demanding show vocally. Our lead in the show is an alumni, and he's been wanting to play the role of Uznavi for a very, very long time and it's a challenge. He's got a lot of rap songs, a lot of lyrics to memorize. You know, the show contains a lot of strong themes, and I think with what the world in our country and even here in Sacramento is going through, it, it hopefully will relax people a little bit, you know, and see that in the end, uh, people can get along, people can love each other, people can find peace, harmony, and happiness within a community. So I hope that's what it does. It's what it does for me and it's what it does for the cast. They seem to be happier at the end of rehearsal and forgetting about their, their problems and homework they need to do. Uh, the show takes them away from that and that's what live theater should do. It should take you to another place. <laughs>